Hello and welcome to Altia Suite. Today I'm going to show you on how we can put a sales invoice on hold. To get started, what we'll do is go to sales and go into sales invoices. And we're going to create a new one. Now that we're here in the new invoice screen, what we'll do is start adding to our invoice. So first I'll add a customer and then I will add an item. I'll say at this point that you want to save this invoice, but you don't want to collect any more payments. What you want to do is basically save this as is. So here down at the bottom, we do have this option to put this invoice on hold. And as soon as I click this hold button, now you can see this invoice has a status right here, held. And as you can see, if we come over here to the invoice number, there is no invoice number associated with it. It will only get associated after the invoice has been saved. Now what it can do at this point is come over here to the context menu and when I'm ready to continue this invoice, I can click on the three dot menu and click on pick invoice. This will pick my held invoice from where I left off at, which was just adding the customer and an item. Now to put this invoice on hold a second way, what we can do is go up to the top and we can press this X and it will give me this option right here to hold the invoice. Here you will also get an option to be able to filter out your held invoices. So if you have a lot of them over time, you could easily filter this out. Right now we'll go up to the status option right up here and we have this held option. And then I'm gonna hit apply. And this is how I can see all my held invoices. And that's how to put a sales invoice on hold in Altia Suite. Thank you.